Hello, this is Mike Adams, and I decided to try an experiment where I posted on my Facebook that friends could leave a question related to racism. So this is the first installment of Ask Mike About Racism. So my friend Alicia asks, what's the deal with the OK hand symbol? I'm afraid to make it now. The problem is it's kind of a knee-jerk symbol to make. Gotcha. Alicia, this is actually a complex question. I had to do a little bit of research, and the best information I found was on the Anti-Defamation League's website. The ADL provides a surprisingly in-depth analysis of the OK hand symbol. First, the OK hand symbol has been used in European cultures to communicate understanding, agreement, or well-being since the 1600s. I didn't know that. The same symbol also carries significance among Hindu, Buddhist, and yoga practitioners. Roughly, it translates to inner perfection. So how, how did this symbol become associated with white supremacist hate? We have to rewind the clock to 2017 when members of the 4chan site began promoting the idea that when the OK symbol was made with the right hand, it displays a W and a P which is supposed to symbolize white power. These 4chan members did this as a hoax. They, they really just wanted to see if they could get liberals and mainstream media, mainstream media, to condemn the symbol. However, the gesture was soon adopted by right-wing extremist trolls, and in a short time it was being used by actual right supremacists, and they weren't using it ironically. What does that mean? First, I'll point out the obvious. It illustrates how some people are just plain and simply assholes. But is it okay for you to use the okay hand symbol when you want to communicate agreement, understanding, or well-being? Yeah, go for it. I would, however, caution against posing for any pictures, especially with a group of white po folks, while flashing the okay hand signal. Roger Stone did this with the Proud Boys, a group of right-wing extremists, and it is not a good look. People might assume that you're either a racist or racist sympathetic, like Stone is, and most decent people will assume that you're either an asshole or, at the very least, you are asshole adjacent.